Hey everyone, Joel Ants here. For today's video, we're gonna be in Oklahoma City. Yes, Oklahoma City, OKC, right downtown actually, at Cafe de Lazy. I believe that's how it's pronounced. Anyway, um, so this is a really cool place and they have this big steamed bun challenge, which we're doing today. So this challenge consists of 30 giant steamed buns and there's a whole bunch of different flavors, such as like a char siu, um, I believe there's like tofu. I think there's one with shrimp. I'll get you all those details there. Um, that being said, I know it's only a 20 minute time limit. It is a lot, a lot of food. If you complete it, you get the meal for free. Um, it's about $80. Um, so yeah, it's going to be, it's going to be a sizable challenge. It's going to be tough. I mean, it's like I said, these things are massive, but I do love a good steam bun and I've heard great things about this place. So anyway, we'll uh, head over there. Let's get you some more details about the food, about the challenge, and ultimately let's go eat. All right, so here with all the food and I also got Mr. Chef Voon here to actually walk us through each of the different flavors because there's a lot of different things in these steam buns, but they all look really, really delicious. So my friend, what do we have in front of us here? All right, we're gonna go from right side to the left side here, we got the pork belly steam buns, we got char siu steam bun, honey sriracha, tofu, and the shrimp with a truffle aioli. Ooh, okay, I love truffle. So this is a chicken char siu, right? Chicken char siu. Cool, and then the, uh, you said the pork belly. Yes. This is the honey sriracha? Honey sriracha. Okay, I like, I, I, I'm good with both of those flavors. And then the tofu. Now what's on the tofu here? There's a lot of an orange dressing. What yes, is that? that's ginger dressing, and then we have shredded carrots and scallions. Okay. And very simple, but it's so good. It's so so good. good. I like it, guys, and I will say, a lot of you made your little iffy of tofu. Let me know if you like tofu down below. It is not bad. You gotta give it a shot. Seriously, tofu, when it is done right, I'm sure yours is done right, it's good. So, uh, hey, my friend, well, thanks for walking us through what we got here. Looks delicious, so let's get started here just momentarily. So how about we get started, grab one of these little guys, bonds, bonds, and uh, let's get a rock and roll on how we say the count of five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Delicious. Mm. The flavor on there with that sauce, that cucumber. Mm. Very fresh. A little bit of spice to it. Great flavor though. Hey everyone, welcome to Zidores. Today we're here in Oklahoma City. Yes, Oklahoma City, OKC, eating some delicious steam buns. So I really like these steam buns. Some people call them bows, steam buns. Um, Cafe de Lazy here calls them uh, steam buns, so I'll just go with what they call them. So here we had such a variety of different flavors, guys. I try one of these tofu ones, ginger, cucumber, carrots. We had, um, you know, of course, like pork belly, which was oh so good. We had those lovely shrimp. Um, like, we just, I mean, I already kind of talked about different flavors, and we had Chef do it, so I won't mention too much more about that. You're yeah, right, that's real good. Ginger is beautiful. Very soft, too. Very, very, very soft. Those are easy to eat. But a pretty straightforward challenge, the 30 buns, 20 minute time limit. Definitely a lot of food. If I had to speculate, I'd say this was probably about seven, maybe seven and a half pounds. Um, so it was definitely a lot. What I really appreciated was just how nice and like everything was not just presented. Try the honey sriracha chicken. These are everybody's favorite. But it was tasting like it was super super good tasting and there's a mayonnaise a honey and a sriracha drizzle on it what i really liked as well is they held like the food perfectly so sometimes when i go to places and they make giant orders um you know like they'll create 
one kind and then it has to sit there for a while nope everything was hot everything was um, juicy everything was fresh I love the different aiolis and sauces they used on all of the ba uh, steam buns um, the addition of like the jalapenos and just everything just a really really nice overall flavor Try pork belly they have some really cool seasonal and or like kind of monthly renditions they throw in so sometimes they'll do like a fried fish or they'll do you know uh, some other kind of like Whoa. bon me you know sandwich like they have a really cool kind of rotating items great flavor mm. so uh so soft Amazing. The place itself is actually a beautiful restaurant right downtown. Um, great, like, you know, visibility in there. Great lighting. So I appreciated that. Um, but yeah, overall, like I said, we're in the quest for the free meal. It was roughly about 80 bucks. And uh, that was about that. So pretty straightforward, guys. But I hope you enjoy the rest of this video. The honey sriracha reminds me a little bit almost like a Nashville. Maybe it's the pickles on it. That's definitely a strong flavor. Trying these shrimp. Uh, let me know if you've ever had a steamed bun before, like this style of steamed bun. Some places even I've heard them referred to as like borderline puffy tacos. That's seafood. Or like at least as a description. That's definitely not how I would describe them. Definitely some citrus in that. A little bit of spice too. Definitely a bit of spice. But if you're wondering what this is like, it is a lovely, fluffy um, kind of, I'll call it bun. Um, is It is a uh, soft, delicate texture, which has a little bit of a chew, a little bit of a sponge to it. I really like it. So yeah, and then obviously when you put your different meats on it, it just creates a whole awesome experience. So I really like these steam buns. And at that, let's get to the rest of the video. That is good, like, I'm not gonna lie. And let me know down below if you've ever had a bow or a steam bun, whatever you're gonna call them. I like these. They're really, really good. We like, it's like a puffy, fluffy, light bun. I really like them. If you haven't tried it, it's worth a shot. And we're coming on six minutes in. A lot of food. We weighed this. Weighed it out and it was about seven pounds, so ain't no shortage. Ooh, filling up though. Definitely, these buns are pretty filling. You don't need to eat 30, no one does. The pork belly is really good. It's crazy, I have to go in pork belly to the tofu. You get the difference how rich this is? This one is so rich and savory compared to that. Good flavor though. Just over 10 minutes in. Make it away. I tell you, I'm getting a little cold actually. Drink all these cold liquids.
well air conditioned here. Like 106 degrees outside. Three left. Ooh, like I said, those pork belly ones. Those are some heavy hitters. Super rich. Very delicious, but heavy hitters. Ooh. Back to the uh, honey sriracha chick <coughs> chicken, excuse me. shrimp is actually really good like I said it's a lot spicier than I anticipated maybe it's the jalapenos and or the batter a little bit of the uh, truffle aioli on it adds a nice flavor and definitely get some citrus which goes well with the seafood but last one just over 14 minutes in Anyway, we are finished there. Excuse me. Ooh. Get some air. All right, so I think it was about 14 minutes, maybe 45 seconds. Excuse me, Ooh, lots of air in there. Overall, you guys, really, really good. Excuse me, Ooh. like I said, lots, lots of air. Many comments to the chef. It was well-deserved, very, very much enjoyed those. I gotta say, such a dynamic though. So you had the tofu, which was incredibly light, uh, just like kind of light tasting with the ginger, like super, super, super fresh. We had the incredibly savory, savory pork belly over here, which again, were really good, great porky flavor. But man, those ones, that'll fill you up. Those were really, really rich. I think if I had to pick my favorite, I'd probably go with the, uh, the char siu, the char siu chicken. I um, really like that. It was uh, just kind of like, it was like the, like you get the, I, get, I think the chicken's grilled. So it's a grilled with a lovely, uh, just kind of light sauce and marinade kind of on it. With a little bit of the vegetables was a really nice addition. Great flavor. Honey sriracha one, I think, was probably my second favorite. That or the tofu, actually. Both of those were super, super, super good. Uh, I did like the shrimp one as well. Um, a lot spicier than I anticipated. Like, I actually have a little bit of a mouth burn going on, uh, which I'm quite surprised about. Uh, but it was really nice as well, though, the citrus and everything. Um, so at that, we do get the meal for free, which is pretty cool. I do want to give a huge thank you to Chef. I'll have to go thank him personally again for walking us through we had here. Uh, but yeah, Sapin's super friendly. Um, cool locations right downtown. Like, literally, there's buildings all around. Uh, but yeah, pretty cool. Um, no complaints. I did, didn't necessarily know I'd eat steam buns in Oklahoma, but I'm very happy to have eaten these steam buns in Oklahoma. They're very, very delicious. Um, so that everyone, like we said, uh, about the $85 meal for free. And uh, that's about that. So, close to next time. If you're ever in the area, definitely stop on by. You don't need to eat 30 of these buns yourself. But you can grab yourself, uh, I think I sell them by two or three and six, etc. So grab yourself some buns. Definitely good. This is what they're most known for. I can definitely see why. And uh, that's about that, guys. So, close to next time. So happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating. Have a lovely day. I'm drinking Diet Dr. Pepper today. Yes, Diet Dr. Pepper. That is a thing. A bigger thing because it's available on all the fountains in the southern United States. I want to say it was like, it's either Virginia and or North Carolina, like that latitude and over, in my opinion. Let me know where you see Diet Dr. Pepper on a fountain pop near your fountain machine near you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. So let everyone, like I said, have a lovely day. I appreciate you. They have some more items. Maybe I'll try something else. So, until next time. That's it.
Happy eating. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And with that, thank you so much, you rock.